pilot is Nisha. The pilot is Indrani, that is me, and crew member is Tarika. Over to you, Nisha. Uh, thank you, ma'am. Uh, hi, good evening, everyone. So today we'll be uh, going to Italy and learn about a few uh, uh, famous zoo, amusement parks, and airports that are there in Italy. These are just a few pictures in Italy. And uh, so, yeah. So basically, a little about Italy. It is located in Southern Europe. And it is famous for our favorite junk food. Like all of us are, uh, all of us, our favorite junk food is, you know, pizzas, pastas, and ice creams. So Italy, all of this food was born in Italy and it's the base of Italy only. So it's famous for its food like pizza, pasta, cheese, and ice cream. Also the country, it covers an area of 301 and 318 kilometers square. It is like, 80% size of Japan. And also, uh, like the video, like uh, the capital and the largest city of Italy is Rome. And uh, the currency is Euro. Also, uh, uh, talking about, um, this is like a few festivals and few destinations that uh, are there in Euro. The picture of a, on the second in the bottom is the Christmas. And these, these are just a few festivals and it, it is so colorful and all the destinations, it's so attractive. So you can just take an idea uh, from the picture. Now we'll be uh, having a look at the zoo of Italy. And uh, I hope you guys have fun. So the first zoo is Parco Zoo. And it is a zoo with uh, species from antelopes to zebras. And it, it also has like a playground and restaurant for visitors to rest. Also, it is known as Parco Park. Like, uh, it, it's a second name for zoo. Also, it is located in Lignano in Italy. There's a place called Lignano where the zoo is located. This zoo, it's a home for 1,000 animals with 150 different species. And it is uh, specially created for their needs. This zoo is 30 years old. It was made uh, 30 years before, like today. Just a few pictures of the zoo and the animals that are there over there. So you can just have a look. Next, uh, we'll be uh, coming to the Aquarium of Genoa. So, Aquarium of uh, Genoa is the largest aquarium in the whole country of Italy. It's located in Old Harbour area and it is a, a 3300 square feet aquarium. Also, it has 1.2 million visitors each year because it's like the largest aquarium in, and it has very attractive sea animals. So, it is very famous and then they have 1.2 million visitors each year. It has sea animals like penguins, dolphins, and other fishes. You can just have a look of the attractive animals. Like turtles, you can see, and penguins. And then they have other fishes over there in uh, the aquarium. Next, moving on to the Gardenland Sea Life Aquarium. Uh, it is located in the Gardenland Resort. Like uh, Gardenland Resort is a complex. It has parks and a zoo also. We'll be discussing that later on. And it has about 5,000 creatures and 100 different species in this aquarium. And it has like large windows and transparent domes to, for a better view and an attractive view. It has sea animals like sharks and Napoleon fishes. And as we can see, it has a fish, Nemo. I guess everyone would be knowing that. And these are just a few other fishes that are there in the aquarium. Next, we have Parco Natura Viva. It is a safari park and zoo in Veneto, Italy. It is spread in 24,000 square feet and it has 1,500 animals and 250 endangered species in the whole zoo. 
so it's like a safari park yeah like you can it's not necessary that the animals are in a cage you can just go for a safari ride and take a look at the zoo and it is one of the most important zoo collections in italy it was built in 1969 it has animals such as tigers giraffes zebras and they have many more animals you can just have a look in the pictures there are lions and tigers and zebras and then there are white lions so these are just uh, an example of how the animals are there uh, so now we'll be taking a look at a video so that you will have a better idea of how the zoos are over there and you Mom, I like the monkey, monkey one. Okay. Uh, so I I hope you all had fun looking at the video, and we all took a quick tour to the zoo, sitting at our homes like that's really great. And so now we'll be taking a quick quick walk in the airports of Italy. and uh, getting like a few information on that so the first airport we'll be discussing is the milan airport it is like the largest international airport in the northern italy it serves 17 million uh, passengers per year it is the 20th busiest airport in europe and it has like two terminals and two runways one runway is used for cargo and uh, the other is used for domestic and international takeoffs and landing and uh, this airport is the busiest for uh, freight and cargo in the whole country and uh, moving on to next airport is the rome airport i hope we we all aware of the place rome and uh, this airport is also known as the uh, leonardo da vinci airport and it is like one of the busiest airport in 2019 and it served 43.5 million passengers which made it the busiest airport in 2019 it is the eighth busiest airport in europe and 47th busiest airport in 2017 and this whole airport it covers an area of 16 kilometers and it was born in 1961 so it's like almost about 40 years since this airport has been established next is the venice airport as we all know venice is like one of the most beautiful destinations in our uh, world and it is a great spot for the travelers and visitors and for a vacation so the airport is also known as venice marco polo airport marco polo he was a writer or merchant and a traveler so this tra uh, so this airport is basically named after him and this airport had handled 11 million passengers in 2018 it is the fourth busiest airport in the whole country and it was established in 2002 so this airport it serves a base for two airlines that i the airlines are easyjet airline and volotia airline we'll be uh, moving on to next airport that is the bologna airport this airport is named after a native person like his name is uh, guglielmo macroni that person he was an electrical engineer and a nobel winner so that airport is named after him also uh, it has only one this airport has only one runway its dimensions are 2800 meters and it carries about 3 million passengers annually like every year it ca carries about 3 million passengers and this airport it has a special feature feature it's like it has a monorail that connects the airport to the railway station so that the person he he or she can just reach from the station to the airport in just 8 minutes so i think that's really that's really exciting so now we'll be having a look at another video of the airport in italy okay ma'am beta 
Okay, so do you know the international air? Do you know the national airlines of the family? Na national flag carrier. Anyone? Okay, it's Italia. Now we have presentation. So please, uh, we shall to start. Uh, so I hope you all like the video and we just took a quick tour of the Italy, one of the airports in Italy. Now we'll be going to amusement parks and amusement parks are all of our favorites, right? No one could say no to uh, amusement parks. And we'll also have a look at all the fun rides that amusement parks have. So the first one is Rainbow Magic Land. Like the name is so interesting, right? It must be so interesting over here. We can see in the pictures also. It's so uh, the rides are so interesting. So this uh, amusement park, it is located in Valmont in Italy. It covers about like uh, 16,000 square feet. It offers a 38 attractions and uh, this amusement park, it has some amazing activities like rotating house, it has free fall, roller coaster, haunted house, and many more. It is just uh, on a distance from 50 kilometers away from Rome. We just uh, discussed Rome. It's like the largest city in Italy, right? Uh, the second one is the Gardenland Park. Gardenland, as we discussed earlier, it was the zoo. So I just said, as I mentioned that we'll be discussing later. So it's like one complex and that in that one complex, they have zoo, they have park, they have water park. So it's many activities under one complex only. Isn't that interesting? And it is located in Northeastern Italy. It's like the most magical park in Italy. We can see that in the picture. We can have an idea of how it is. It covers about Two lakh meters. Wow, ma'am, it is so cool. Yes, right. It's so interesting, and it's uh, it also has resorts, water park, and amusement park all in one. So you can take a view of water park, amusement park, resorts, everything at once only. It was made in nineteen seventy five, and it offers rock shows and fun activities. So let's move on to next. The next one is Mirabilandia. Uh, park and it is located in Savio, Italy. It is the biggest park of Italy. Like it is located, it is spread out in the uh, most wide area, and the the area is a fifty thousand square meter. Can you just imagine? Oh my God! And it has like an additional water world as well. So, uh, which is by the name of Mirabilandia Beach. It has about one point four million visitors per year. And it has fun rides such as Twin Tower, Upside Down, and many more fun rides. The next one is Edinlandia uh, Park. It is located in Naples, Italy. It is one of the most oldest park in Italy. It was born in 1965. One of the best known parks in Italy, as it is the oldest, and it has uh, it offers like different activities such as Ferris Wheel, Moon Park, Dragon, and many more. And this park is made on the theme of Disneyland. It was inspired from Disneyland Park in California. So we can just have a look by the pictures and take a uh, and take an idea of how it is. So this was all for today, but we'll uh, also have a video so that you can take an idea of how the amusement parks are. So I would request a video of uh of an amusement park in Italy? Yeah, ma'am, I also like the rides also of the amusement parks in Italy. Anybody want to say something? Can no, ma'am. Can I show a video of 
of amusement park in Italy? No. We can't allow videos. Okay. Bye. Okay, so for tomorrow, we will be visiting Kenya. Mom, okay. Mom, tomorrow Mom, you're what? visiting K-E-N-Y-A, Kenya. Kenya? Yes. Okay, Kenya. So do you all aware of this country? Yes, ma'am. It is in Africa. It is in Africa. Yes. Okay, so anyone of you know about any of the African animals? I know a lot of them. Okay. Okay, so that was all about our today's session, today's to, to the Italy. I hope you all have enjoyed. And for tomorrow, we will be visiting Kenya. So I hope you all be so excited to visit, right? So we'll meet you tomorrow at the same time. Bye-bye, guys. Bye, Bye ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Have a nice day, ma'am.